Lori Bassart, and this is my son, Corey. Corey is 29 years old and he is autistic. Today, Corey and I are gonna demonstrate how to do a come here drill. And it's just like it sounds, this is a drill to teach your autistic child to come when they're called. This drill is super duper easy, and it's actually a lot of fun. Your autistic child will like doing this drill. Uh -huh. To do a come here drill, you need some helpers. And I have some helpers here, I have some friends here that are gonna help me. This is Maria, and this is Sarah. We all have a little dish of M&Ms here that we're gonna be using to reward Corey. And so we're just gonna go ahead and get started. We're gonna spread out, and we're just gonna uh, take turns calling Corey, and when he comes, he gets a little M&M as a reward. So let's get started. Corey, come here. Good job. Corey, come here. Good job. Corey, come here. Good job. Corey has been an angel and he's come every time we've called him, but now we want to demonstrate what to do if your autistic child does not come when you call them. Sarah here is going to play the part of a little autistic child who does not come when I call her. So I'm going to call her, but she's going to be kind of playing and doing her own thing and so she's just going to ignore me. Sarah, come here. No, Sarah, come here. Now that correction may have seemed very straightforward, but there's kind of actually a lot of subtle things that are going on there. So I'm gonna kind of break it down really small. Um, first of all, in a come here drill, your child only gets one chance to comply and then you gotta go get them. But that's actually a good thing because it kind of helps eliminate a very common mistake that a lot of parents make when they call their child. They kind of go, come here. Come here. I say, come here right now. I'm going to count to three. You don't want to do that. So I'm going to break down exactly how to do the correction very precisely into a three-step sequence. So first of all, I'm going to be standing here at point A. Sarah's going to be standing over there at point B. I'm going to call her. I give her just a second or two to comply. And then I'm going to start the sequence. And the first step in the sequence is I walk quickly and decisively over to her. Step two in the sequence, I take her by the hand while simultaneously verbalizing the correction. No, Sarah, come here. Step three, I take her back to point A where I call her from, and then you can praise and reward her like this. Very good. Good job, Sarah. The reason that I'm being so persnickety about the three-step sequence is that way it makes it very clear and concise and very easy for your child to understand what come here means because while they're hearing the words come here, you're going to be showing them at the same time. The benefit for doing this drill consistently is you will very quickly start to see this generalized spontaneously in real life. And I want you to kind of keep your eye out for it because anytime you see your child come to you spontaneously, spontaneously in real life, that's the time to really heap on the praise and maybe have a super duper special cookie and just kind of have a party when they come to you spontaneously in real life. You know, the reason that I wanted to make this training video is I really want to help parents learn the correct way to teach your autistic child to come when you call them. Because I think if you can have success in this one small little area, it'll just lead to more and more success and bigger and bigger successes with your autistic child. And you can help your little autistic child become the best little autistic child they can be. You know, you kind of learn how to become a parent from your own parents, and I had wonderful parents, but they didn't really prepare me for Corey. I had to have a lot of special training and a lot of special help. The two psychologists that trained me in this type of therapy were Dr. Mitch Taubman and Dr. Ron Leaf, and they helped me for almost eight years. They have co-authored a book that goes into a lot more detail on this type of therapy than I've been able to go into just by doing this training video. And I want to make that resource available for you. If you are interested in purchasing that resource, you can just click on the link below. 
They have another associate named Dr. John McCacken, and he has written a book that has a curriculum that goes along with it, and it also goes into a lot more detail on this type of therapy than I've been able to go into just by doing this training video. And I want to make that resource available for you as well. Anyway, I want to thank you very much for visiting my website, Parenting Solutions for Autism, and thanks for watching our video. Mr. Corey, can you say bye, see ya? Bye, see ya. Bye, see ya. Bye. Bye.